For some families, the solution that they can find is a comprehensive care approach. There are programs that handle all aspects of your special needs child's care, that take care of your therapies, all your different medical providers, and in most cases, they also provide outlets for the mental health care. Uh, that the children need. That sort of a program wasn't actually available to my family, so we built basically our own comprehensive care program. We made sure that Alex's pediatrician and his school psychologist and his mental health care provider all kept really good communication. We kept good records. We made sure that everybody had access to everyone else's treatment notes so that we were all on the same page, so that Alex could see any one of them and that they were aware of what was happening with the treatment from the other. And it's really important, especially when you're communicating um, between providers to make sure that there is that open dialogue because sometimes it's easy to get pigeonholed into one or the other and just concentrate on separate ones. But if you can get uh, the right communication and the right interaction between your providers, then it can help your child as they grow and, and they can approach this in an integrated way.